Okay, so if you've ever tried to hide a staff inside of Finale 2012, um, you might have just had no luck, no success doing it so. And I'm going to show you one little trick, one little detail that probably is where your problem is. I'm working on this score called Under Pressure. And at the beginning of the score, I do need to have both treble and bass clef. So that's perfect. I've already aligned how I want this to look. Now, when I get to my letter A where uh, the singing starts, I do not need to have treble and bass clef and only need one. So I will need to hide the bass clef from here to down here. And in order to do that, you will usually just click your staff tool, go to the staff, select it, probably go down here with press your shift, press down here. Now you have all that selected, right click and go in here where it says hide empty staffs. Sounds perfectly to do. And if you do that, probably it won't work. Of course, it's going to work now with me because I have already made this change. But the problem is in here. If it doesn't work, the problem is because you need to be to make this little change in here in your edit group attributes. If you don't have where it says hide normally and you have only hide if all staffs empty, this is what's going to happen. You're going to try to get it out, hide it and nothing. You're like going like, what? Well, that's your problem. You need to go into the group, right click, edit, and then hide normally needs to be there. Do not use never hide because it will never work. Hide normally. Okay. And now we can go here, right click, hide, and it worked. We can go here, tell it to hide up to here. Hide empty. I'm going to press escape twice to get out of this mode. And now you can see it took away the group, took away everything. And I'm only seeing one staff, which is exactly what I wanted. And that's the little trick that you need to use to be able to hide staffs inside of Finale 2012. Hope this really helps you out. You can leave me any comments, any questions here on YouTube on the comments, or you can also reach me via email, me at jorgesilvestrini.com. Follow me on Twitter at jsilvestrini. And lastly, you can also add me on Google Plus, and it will be uh, google.com forward slash plus Jorge Silvestrini. Those are the ways you can reach me. Hope I am able to help you in the near future. And keep coming back to the website and to the YouTube channel. Talk to you very soon. Have a great one. Bye-bye.